Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. According to challenges on March 22, 2024, Thales Belfast, employing approximately 600 workers, is poised to significantly ramp up production of several missile types. These include the lightweight multi-role missile, LMM, known as the Martlet in the British Army, the Starstreak surface-to-air missile, and the NLAW, next-generation light anti-tank weapon, designed by Swedish company Saab but exclusively manufactured at the Thales facility. Alex Cresswell, CEO of Thales UK, has confirmed the plan to double the plant's output, with an annual production rate expected to reach several thousand missiles. This expansion is in response to the urgent demand stemming from the conflict in Ukraine and the necessity to replenish British military inventories. The production increase encompasses not only the modern NLAW and LMM slash Martlet missile systems but also the Starstreak missile, which has recently experienced a resurgence in demand and strategic relevance. Data from the Swedish think tank Cipri indicates substantial UK support to Ukraine, including deliveries of 6,900 laws, 1,800 Starstreaks, and 300 LMM Martlets throughout 2022 and 2023. The NLAW, Next Generation Light Anti-Tank Weapon, also known as MBT Law or RB-57, is a man-portable anti-tank missile system developed by Saab to meet the operational needs of the British and Swedish armed forces. Initiated in 1999 and entering production in 2008, the NLAW is designed to empower individual soldiers to counter modern tanks across various combat scenarios and terrains. It features a disposable launcher and a missile capable of engaging armored vehicles, with a production order announced by the British Ministry of Defence in December 2022 for assembly in Northern Ireland. The NLAW system includes a fire and forget missile capable of ranges between 20 to 600 metres, with an effective range for moving targets up to 400 metres. The launcher, designed for single operator use, is equipped with an optical sight offering 2.5 times magnification. The system offers two primary modes of operation, overfly top attack, OTA, for armored targets and direct attack, DA, for softer targets like vehicles or structures. The OTA mode allows the missile to detonate above the target for increased effectiveness against armored vehicles, while the DA mode is suitable for direct hits on less protected targets. The predicted line of sight, PLOS, guidance system requires the operator to maintain a target lock briefly before launching. The NLA's fire and forget technology and missile design ensure operator and personnel safety even in confined spaces. The Starstreak, developed by Thales Air Defense, is a surface-to-air missile engineered to engage short-range aerial targets. It boasts exceptional speed, surpassing Mach 4, making it the fastest missile of its kind for short-range engagements. The system features a semi-automatic command to line-of-sight, SACLOS, laser beam guidance system, enhancing target engagement accuracy while reducing susceptibility to countermeasures. Upon launch, the missile releases three darts, each containing an explosive charge made of a tungsten alloy, to increase the likelihood of target interception. Introduced into service in 1997, the Starstreak system has been utilized globally by multiple armed forces, including the United Kingdom and Ukraine, in various configurations such as man-portable air defense systems, manpads, and vehicle-based systems like the Stormer HVM. Also developed by Thales Air Defense, the Martlet, or lightweight multi-role missile, LMM, is designed for air-to-surface, air-to-air, surface-to-air, and surface-to-surface -surface roles. Based on the Starburst surface-to-air missile, the Martlet is compatible with a range of platforms, including helicopters, drones, and naval and ground vehicles. Weighing approximately 13 kilograms and measuring 1.3 meters in length, the missile features a high-explosive blast fragmentation or shape charge warhead and utilizes various guidance systems, including semi-active laser, SAL, infrared, IR, and GPS-INS for targeted engagement. Capable of exceeding speeds of Mach 1.5, the Martlet, which entered service in 2021 with full operational capability anticipated by 2025, boasts an operational range of up to 8 kilometers. The development of the Martlet also encompasses variants such as the Freefall LMM, FFLMM, or Fury, a glide bomb version. That's all for now, see you later.